Since your commitment, you have written some brilliant articles for the Northern Medical Journal of Psychiatry. Thank you, Frederick. I just finished your most recent piece. Extraordinary stuff. A particularly good one. It may be my favorite. I have seen a lot of hostility. But this was quantifiably bitchy. Do you think I am your nemesis? No, uh, nemesis, no. You refuted my entire book. It didn't hold up to scrutiny. Of course it didn't. I was lying. On your behalf! To save your life! You refuted your insanity defense. I went out on a limb for you, and you climbed up there and sawed it off! Wood burns because it has the proper stuff in it. And a man becomes famous because he has the proper stuff in him. You don't have the proper stuff, Frederick. I am a best-selling author. The journals only still publish your writing for the freak value of your byline. The attention given to you is dwindling since you have been overshadowed by another creature. That book is writing itself. I think I'll call it the Dragon Slayer. All I need is the ending. Fate has a habit of not letting us choose our own endings, Frederick. This is the ending fate has chosen for you. Your teeth will go and your strength. Nobody will be afraid of you anymore. After Dr. Bloom's reign, you will be out in the ward. The young ones will push you around and use you for sex. All you'll get to read is what you write on the wall. You have seen the old ones. They cry when they do not like the stewed apricots. Oh. I am just going to leave an extra copy of my book right over here. Thank you, Frederick. I've personalized it for you.